Welcome everyone. Got some new mods for the Life's Mazda 3. A Cork Sport High Flow Air Intake. This might be one of the easiest mods that you can do in the engine bay. It looks pretty simple. I'll show you a few steps of removing it. And uh, everybody knows that these things are silent driving down the road, so I won't even bother with a before sound. But we will definitely get some after sounds, some drive-bys and some interiors and some wide open throttles just for fun, like we always do in all the other videos. So I'll show you guys a little bit how to put this in and uh, we'll go from there. All right, this came with some um, great step-by-step -step instructions, but I'm just going to show you a quick rundown of, you know, how actually easy this is. You need to take this cover off because you need to be able to get to this screw and that makes it just a little easier. You're also going to pull this little breather valve off. This is all going to be replaced. This is all going to be replaced. Mass airflow sensor comes with a brand new fancy bullet housing here where it'll be transferred over to. Uh, this replaces that little flex hose. This will be attached to this, to this, to that, there. This is held in with just a few screws, a couple 10 millimeter screws all around, and this whole assembly will basically lift out. So after we disconnect this mass airflow sensor and this little wire here, it'll hang free and out of the way. We want to make sure that we don't get any damage on this while it's out. I actually usually like to take them right out and install them right into this even before it's over here. That way it's inside inside this and won't get hurt. Uh, just a nice uh, airflow filter here. Um, it says do not oil. This is a dry flow filter. So I guess it just needs to be cleaned. Periodically I have to look up that cleaning. Now let's get started a couple of those steps then I'll chime back in. Got these two screws out. I got this screw loosened. Got the breather valve released. And uh, what I like to do is, this this can be kind of snug, so sometimes I like to just go in here with a big fat wedge and kind of break that. Now this whole box should just kind of lift up if you just want to kind of do a wide shot there. Just pull off, which it's gonna. This is all just pressure fitted in. That's off. One big assembly. How about that monstrosity pulling air that's a neat i like this pulling air from the bumper side front bumper but this is just for sound there's not no need for the, any of that so it's funny how this goes down and then down into here now look inside there and now what i was saying is you know i don't like touching this mass airflow sensor it can only orientate one way into this and it has an o-ring that came out with it so you know that's that's real easy to put on it came with all the supplied screws so now we're gonna get this assembled well it's kind of hard to make a video for something that's so simple and there it is uh it just kind of hangs there pulling all this air i like it this uh i mean it's a huge weight savings let's just go with that this monstrosity it looks like an alien spaceship why it has all that i have no clue oh i know engineers they needed a job and they came up with that well anyways we'll get some good uh pulls sound clips that's what everybody wants to know how this thing sounds with the magnaflow exhaust and the air intake together it should sound amazing the wife is probably excited to hear it. So we're gonna go out and test it as soon as I wash up a little bit. All right, see you in a minute. So the windows are down and it might be a little wind noise, but it definitely sounds good. Even with the Magnaflow exhaust, it's pretty silent usually. And now, that sound, if it's translating into the phone, is all intake. speeds out. Uh, 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 there it goes. 35. Alright, now we're going to do some drive-bys.
quick sound bite. This is all the windows up. Still very nice inside this interior, very quiet. But you can definitely tell there's something been done to it. It sounds it sounds right. It doesn't sound ricey. It doesn't sound just it just sounds right. It's very deep sound. It's not obnoxious, but come on by. Somebody will feel it in their bones, and that's kind of nice. You know, that they're like, oh, there's something done to that. And that's what you want. You don't need to have this thing all loud, so loud that it annoys the neighbors. Alright. There we go.